Unpacking the meaning of just off the docks. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an intriguing English phrase that you might come across in movies, books, or casual conversations, just off the docks. This expression has a rich background and usage that we're going to explore. Stay tuned as we unravel the layers behind this phrase and learn how it can add flavor to your English conversations. Just off the docks, refers to something or someone that has recently arrived from another country or place, typically by ship. Historically, it paints a picture of goods being unloaded from ships at the docks, fresh and new, directly to the consumers. When applied to people, it suggests someone who is new to a country or place, possibly unfamiliar with the local customs or language. The phrase originates from the days when sea travel was the primary means of international transport. Docks were bustling hubs of activity where goods from around the world were brought in. Saying something was just off the docks implied it was fresh, new, and possibly exotic. Over time, the expression evolved to describe not just goods but also people who have recently arrived in a new place, carrying the connotation of being unacquainted or fresh to local customs. In modern usage, it's important to exercise sensitivity when using the phrase, especially in reference to people. While it can convey a sense of newness and excitement, it might also unintentionally imply that someone is an outsider or not yet integrated into the local culture. In a globalized world, being mindful of the implications behind our words is crucial in fostering inclusive and respectful communication. Just off the docks is a colorful expression with roots deep in the history of travel and trade. Whether you're using it to describe the latest goods or to illustrate the journey of adapting to a new place, remember the richness and depth it adds to the language. We hope this video has enriched your understanding of this phrase and its nuances. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more insights into the fascinating world of English language learning.